Hi and welcome to a new video. Once in a while, you might come across some interesting photos or videos on your contacts WhatsApp status and wish to download them locally to your iPhone. Unfortunately, WhatsApp doesn't have a built-in feature yet for downloading any posted status. In this video, I will show you how you can use your iPhone's built-in tools to download any WhatsApp status, whether it's an image or a video. Let's go! For WhatsApp statuses that are in image format, you can easily save them on your iPhone by simply taking a screenshot. Afterwards, open the Photos app and then you can either crop the screenshot image or leave it as it was, whichever you prefer. If you wish to modify the image, tap on the Edit button at the top right corner and select the Crop option. Drag the corners of the photo and adjust it to the size that suits you. As additional information, your contact will only be notified that you viewed his status, but he will not be informed that you took a screenshot of it. On the other hand, if the WhatsApp status is a video, the best way to save it locally is to use your iPhone's built-in screen recording feature. The screen recording function is easily accessible in the control center. But if you don't see the menu amongst the shortcuts, go to Settings and navigate to Control Center. Locate the Screen Recording option from the listed functionalities, tap on the Add button, and then it should automatically appear in the Control Center. After the setup, start the screen recording and make sure to activate audio capturing so that any sound from the video is also recorded. Allow the screen to record until the video status has completed playing. When you stop the recording, the output is saved in the Photos app automatically. Similar to the earlier method, you can also modify the output video and clip it to the desired frame. To do this, select the Edit button at the top right corner. Then drag the slider to customize the video clips and crop the frame as you would prefer it. Upon creating your adjustments, tap on Done and then save it as a new video clip. And that's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye.